All right, welcome back. I've got uh, WWE belts today, Raw and SmackDown uh, Tag Team Championships. I just wanted to show you how they deliver them. Um, they come in this box here. They got these wrappings on it. They got these nice, really nice belt cases. These super nice belt cases on there. And um, you know, they're, they're properly done. So I'll quickly do an unboxing of these. You can also see here in that wide view, the setup that I've got happening with the minis and the two belts that I've already got as well. So, this is how they do it. Plastic. So, takes about two weeks to ship. These are heavy, man. These are real heavy. Ship in about two weeks. Um, I'll quickly unbox these, show you what they look like, and then I will do quick unboxing of the little minis here. I've got a whole box of minis. And yeah, you tell me what you get. Oh my God, it's a lot of silver. Wow. WWE Raw Championship. I don't know if that's coming up on the camera, but that's quite cool. The belts and the straps, very, very thick straps here. Um, these are the replica from WWE Shop. So, pretty cool. And then, same sort of thing with the SmackDown. Um, in case you didn't notice, I'm sort of getting into the belts at the moment. Um, I've got a bit of a plan for what I do in the future with a... Um, proper collection room, yeah. entire room, gonna do all sorts of stuff in there. You know, one to 18 cars, statues, uh, belts, yeah. swords, knives, helmets, all sorts of stuff. So then there's your, your Smackdown. I actually like the Smackdown one better. Personally, I like the blue. Hopefully that's coming up on the screen. Same sort, of, exactly the same sort of belt, just one's blue and one is red. Really cool. Look at the back. Straps. Authenticated stickering. Blah, blah, blah. So that is the two championships there. Give you a real quick view of what's going on here with my collection at the moment. So you got the replica collection belts there. You've got the minis in their cases here. You got the Intercontinental, Old School, and the um, Undisputed, which is a massive belt, this one. Um, I've got it in a really wide pan shot at the moment, so what I might do, actually, I'll put it down here, and I'll zoom this back in. Try and get some more zoom. Okay, it's not letting me do it. Okay, can't do it. I'll have to go this section. So... Get over here. Move all this. Heavy, man. Heavy. So you get it. Some paperwork. You get the boxing. So I've got Macho Man's um, little mini belt. How cool is that? That is so cool. The way that they've done that. Macho Man mini belt replica. It's got little latches and everything. That's hilarious. That is hilarious. So, Macho Man, ow. Fuck yeah, that's cool. <laughs> that's super cool. So, you know, just done so well. Don't know what that is, might be timber, might be plastic, not sure. You get a little handle belt inside so cool so well done to um wwe shop for that heaps of more belts in here heaps more belts so we got the rock the brum bull i want to do this guy and a look um, i'm obsessed with these at the moment i want to have at least four of those cases oh okay so he's got a suede felt backing Wow, 
That's mad. That is cool. Suede blue on the back. That's awesome. That's fucking mad. Attitude Era European Championship. So. Attitude Era European Championship here. Very, very cool. Nice green leather backing. That's a nice belt. Personally, like the old school belts better than the new school. Um, I don't know what's in. I accidentally bought two of the same belts. So, I fucked up. Um, I actually don't even know what is in this box here. So, oh, okay, here you go. So, this is the Undertaker's. Special. <laughs> you got the Undertaker's special belt here in the mini. Um, let's get this open. Undertaker mini belt here. So eventually I'll get all of these in the large scale as well. So I'm going to have all the minis and all the large scale. Super cool, comes in a little pull-out case. Any collector would, you know, if you know, I'm not really into WWE, but I'm into the collecting side of it. So that's why I'm happy to do this. That is cool. Undertaker, 30, felt backing. Little latches here. Have a look. So this is a raw film, guys. Obviously, wow, super cool. Sorry, I can't get the light on there. That is mad. It's in an urn. It's freaking awesome. Undertaker mini belt. Very, very cool. I don't know where the hell to put all this stuff. Anyway. We got the 2013 WWE Championship here. Um, so like I said, I will get all of these eventually in the large scale. Um, wow, that's nice. That's a nice belt. That's a very nice belt. That's probably one of my favorites actually. NXTs. Mini belt. I love that they all have these little cases. So good. Such a professional way to, to collect. That's a cool looking belt. NXT mini belt. Details are just fucking awesome. Black backing. Cool. Smoking Skull Championship in the mini belt. So I've only been collecting WWE belts for about um, a month and I've got quite a collection already. I just love them. They're just super cool. So you got <laughs> Smoking Skull with the with this snakeskin back. Nice. It's bigger than I thought actually. This plate's way bigger than I thought it would be. Smoking Skull there, snakeskin backing. Too good. Then you have United Kingdom Championship here. So I keep all the um, belt bags, but I don't keep the actual plastic and stuff. So you got the United Kingdom WWE Championship here. It's actually a nice belt too. It's very similar to the WWE one itself. But uh, the widescreen shots here make them look a bit funny. And then you got the last of the um, the second Hulk, uh, not Hulk, Rock, one in here that I accidentally bought twice. But anyway, so there you go, guys. Heap of mini belts. Uh, put them all together, make them nice. Oh, too good. Check that out. 
Check out those there, the special edition ones. I've got all the ones here. I've got my two new belts over there. Actually, these are all new. Super cool. I'll do a proper video of all this. It's just a bit of mess when you unbox, as you can see. So it's just drama, but uh, love it. Love it, love it, love it. I do have heaps of statues coming in too. I've got Apocalypse, um, Aragon from Prime 1, and... Uh, and one other one, um, The Witcher. So, got a ton of uh, statues coming in as well. So stay tuned for those. But for now, we've got some WWE stuff happening. And the collection is growing. Thank you very much for watching.